Hey guys, it's Kate. Um, I don't know if you guys have heard of Dognition, but it's this new behavioral assessment test you can give your dog to see how smart they are, or uh, possibly their personality. Um, I'm not sure yet. Uh, and since I don't have the love of my life, Dottie, with me in San Francisco, she lives with my parents in Sacramento, I'm using my apartment dog, Betty. She's she's all, she's pretty great. She's sort of a freak. She, we call her our grandma dog, because she, here, I'll show you. Look at her, she's so cute. Hi! Um, she always has this look on her face, even when I'm not tormenting her by making her look at the camera, and <laughs> she... She doesn't like boys very much, and um, she barks a lot. But part demon, part chihuahua, part Jack Russell, and I am such a sucker. Um, we're gonna assess how intelligent she is. Um, and Betty's owner, Kat, got very nervous when I told her that, um, but I'm sure Betty will do really well. Okay, right, so uh, let's go through the questions. So first off, it looks like there's a personality test. I'm just doing this to see like, uh, so, so, something about science here, I'm sure. When you laugh, does Betty wag her tail? Betty. 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 <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take that as a. I'm gonna take that as a maybe because she didn't look unhappy about it. Does Betty get easily startled by unfamiliar objects? Yes. Does Betty remember distant human relatives or acquaintances? Betty tries to kill my dates every time they come over, so seldom. Does Betty ever learn how to solve a problem by watching you? Betty cannot reach something. A toy that rolled under the sofa, for example. Does she try to get your attention for help? Okay, Betty. Okay, you see it? Don't look though. Mystery, it's mystery dog. Where are they? Where's your chip? It's under the sofa. I did not put it far enough under there. Betty. Uh, <clears throat> Look to me for help. She is looking to me for help. I can't see her, but she totally gave me a, a mean face. She's she's still going for that chip under the couch. I'm sorry, Betty. I'm sorry. I betrayed you. Does Betty ever intervene in an argument between other members of the household? Yes. This is such a long test. How many words does Betty know? Betty. Um, sit. Shake. Hello. Obstreperous. Stumped you. Bosnia. Baloney. Treat. I'm not gonna say the W word because I can't fulfill that promise right now. Bedtime. Right. This is really mean. I'm sorry. Ten. Yes. 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 I'll, we'll do 11 and 20. Okay, okay, you can get down. I'm sorry. You're being a really good sport. How much excitement does Betty display when you start to play with her? Okay. Hi! I'm displaying very high levels of excitement. Betty, play with me! Betty, where's your baby? Get your baby! Where's your baby? Where's your baby? Where's your baby? Where's your baby? Ah! Betty, please. I guess this is a, a mild excitement. This? Want it? Mild. If you put food in Betty's bowl while she's in another room, yes. This is all just like, is your dog as food motivated as you are? Which the answer is clearly yes. Betty seemed to hear things that you don't. I don't have one. I don't, it's over here. I don't have it. Look. Does Betty look up when you talk? Well, boy. She's just fucking ignoring me right now. She's very mad at me for some reason. Does Betty tend to ignore you if you don't have a food or toy? I don't know. Does Betty tend to ignore me if I don't have a food or toy? Betty. Does Betty react with jealousy when you come into physical contact with someone else? Yeah, you're so good. He's so good. He plays with me. What? 
Now, now you want to play with me? Well, I'm busy. Oh my god, it's finally over. Wait. Begin, cat! You up for it? I'm not supposed to interact with her. <laughs>